coats are very different. Okay? This is a little harder to see. I'm going to turn it in the face, you guys. Yes? You need to copy down your okay. uh, exam information on page now, 9 and then give it to me. He is, um, yeah. Left front and right front are very different. Okay? The right front, I mean, the left front, um, it's a little harder to see here, but he's a little longer in the toe. And on his right side, he's actually got a little bit of a dip in his hook. Okay? We determined that we did hear a clank, and that is a loose shoe. Okay? So that does affect some of his jogging. Um, problems with long, long toes and maybe an uneven barrier is that it can create problems that go up the tendons and to the back, and you can get a lot of soreness over a long time. It can all be fixed. It just is easier if we can prevent it. Okay? All right. So... Um, other things that I like to do on physical exam is put my hand on them and go over their entire body, okay? And to see if I've got, and you can do two exams at once. You can do your physical hands-on exam and you can do part of your neurologic exam, okay? So in the other species, in the dogs, you've got the neurologic exam of everything on their face. Well, we can do all that while we're doing it. So you've got, you know, sticking your hand in and you've got schnauch. Okay, they should pull away from you to where they don't want something in their nose. Okay, also, you notice that he's licking and he's chewing. So he's got his normal there, and then he's got some normal blink, and his face is all menace. Okay, um, we've already touched his ears. We know he's sensitive there, so I'm not going to dwell on it. We just know that it's already notated. Okay, and I'm trying to find anything that, do it while we're here, I always check see that he's got a good jugular, okay, because if he's been stuck a bunch of times, he may have some um, uh, calcification or some scar tissue in there, and we want to see that we've got a good flow back. It also gives us a little bit of a hint as to what he's like to do a stick on, okay? You can also get your hydration test in there by doing your pinch. I also, while I'm doing it, I like to feel and see Part of my neurologic or physical is to see if we've got <coughs> pain that's hidden. And what I'll have is some sort of object, and I'll just run my run it alongside them to see if I can find some pain. Actually, he's okay. I want him to tell me what's going on, and he is going to talk. Yes. Not that. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> so he was, he's a little sore right there. And if you're ever doing this on the rear end, be aware that you are dealing with the most powerful portion of the horse. So they, you know, just keep your distance. Coming over his gluteal and down. Not too bad. A little bit of soreness in the back on the left hand side. Good horses that are sore in the neck. Don't catch that. Mm -hmm. He turned his head towards me, and I stayed there. When I continued, he started to pick up that foot, saying, "You know, lady, I'd rather you not go there." He's talking. He's not being mean. He's just telling me what's going on. Always, whenever I look for something, I try to repeat it, okay? One time is, could be a lie, two times, maybe not, three times, definitely no, okay? So we have a little bit more sensitivity over here. This tells me that this muscle has been tight. Why, I don't know, but, you know, he may have be because of the stuff down there. What happens in the feet gets transferred all the way up to the whole body. Once I've done the deep stuff, then I make sure that we don't have any major problems. Scar tissue wise. Check the digital pulses.
on its right side. Oh. Yeah. He was sore more on the left, but I bet you it's right in here. So she said that he broke about four lead ropes he won't tie. So that takes quite a bit of power. So he's got some issues with that. Okay. So when I go over with the hand, then we get a little deeper, and I usually go and start palpating the tendons on the front uh, to see if we've got some long-term issues. Thank you. 